Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I decided to go ahead and um continue today with some more RPG Maker. I left off with you know making a in my opinion a bunch of progress more than I normally get done in a recording session. So I decided, you know what? Let's just not lose momentum and let's just, you know, keep it up. Now if I can just get, son of a biscuit. I forgot that wire's there. I am using my new headset that I bought a few days ago. I mentioned it in a Fallout 76 video, but that won't be out for quite a while on YouTube. So, that's why you're hearing me mess with the microphone and whatnot. And that's why <coughs> the audio, hopefully, from my voice and whatnot should be better. I know it still picks up clicks and whatnot, but I can't help it. And it's just no longer picking up the refrigerator in the background. So, and yes, that does mean no more um, you using the PS5 controller as my microphone. So, and honestly, this headset I bought, it is incredibly comfortable. Way more comfortable than what I had before. And I was using, what I had before was a, um, Astro A10 and it, it got to the point to where there was so many hairs in the headphones themselves it was just it was no longer usable because of that issue and it was heavy it was it made me sweat it left a head dent was the head didn't wasn't a real issue but honestly but yeah no <laughs> this headset I bought it off of Amazon and it is EKSA if you've never heard of them uh, honestly I'm not sponsored but they are really good headsets in my opinion if they are a crap brand worse than Astro Honestly, I don't care. In my opinion, they're better than Astro. They're, again, they're light. They don't use the, um, that foamy material. They use leather or fake leather for the ears, the headband. It, they are, like, I mean, I, again, by far the most comfortable he full cover ear set. I've used ever and I highly recommend them you can I got the ones I have now for 40 bucks on Amazon you can buy them from their site as well and they are a, supposedly a 7.1 surround sound USB microphone headset combo and yeah I mean ever since using them playing Fallout and all that stuff well, okay, mostly Fallout. Huge difference in sound quality. Humongous difference. Sounds was like something that sounds like it's in my right ear. It's actually not. It's on my left. I can turn around and face away from someone talking, and they and they sound louder. I don't know why that is a thing. It could be the surround sound. But that's never happened with my speakers that I use normally or with the Astros. And if I'm facing them, they sound like they're almost, well not whispering, but like talking normally. Like a normal volume. And again, it could be 
It could be Fallout 76. It could be like a sound issue in that game alone. I don't know. I've only played using them on that game and nothing else. So it could be that game alone. But if this the headsets, wow, they are. I recommend them. I really do. No, I don't want to do this. I want to save. Alright, so I need to figure out where I want an opening at. I kind of want an opening by this tower. For reasons. I want to make the opening grass for now. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to make it dirt. Son of a monkey's uncle. This down here is going to be dirt and it'll transition into brick. I want to try to do my best to do a to do a transition I can't really do a um not without modifying the the um tile sets to where I can have like a a slow transition from like grass to dirt to where like it slowly fades I can't really do that without modifying the, the tile sets or the pixels. And I have no knowledge on how to do that at all. If I knew how to do that, I would. <clears throat> so I want an opening. How big are the... um? How big are the... um? The gates... The event itself will not show me, but if I go into here, it does. It's three wide by how much? So three wide by two, so it's three by two. I'll have to play with it. All right. I'm on the square tool. Okay, that's good. I want it by this. I want it over here, away from this building. I might move that one somewhere else, though. Yeah, like maybe, like, hmm. Maybe not, who knows? I don't know yet. We'll see. We'll see. Um, so I want an entrance. Okay. Actually, I might... Hold on. Instead of up there, I might do it up here instead. Yeah. No, 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 no. Because I want to do... Yeah. I want to have two. One on each side. Okay. So it doesn't need to be that big. Let's find out. Um, and then I'll have to play it to find out how big it needs to be. Okay. There's not going to be any sound because I got rid of the sounds when I was using... Okay, I don't need it that big. Okay. That's actually helpful. So now what I can do is I can do this. I can do this. Actually, no, hold on. Yeah, I can do this and then I still have this reference. So I can move it over to here to where this is now. Okay. Gate one, and it will play this one. Is that a freaking Stargate? What the hell? That's cool. I want this door right there. 
All right. And then I don't need it to be extremely stupid big. I want to put the player model back down now. Which is not the actual person you play as, but he is the main character of the game. Hate on me for that all you want, I don't give a crap. I think it needs to be this big. And then I need to refresh this. That's still too big. No, 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 no. I want him down. Um, I don't know why I keep doing that. I just do. Okay, so I want... So it's... One, two, three, four... Five. So I need it. I need to cut off two. Okay, hold on now. That's the same, I think. Hold on. Let me check. Do I really only need one for it? I only need one. Okay, hold on. Um, this, this, and then this and then is that enough if that's enough that's perfect honestly that's not enough <sighs> well son of a biscuit I guess we're not using gates then are we hmm Unless. Yeah, no, we're not using gates. And I don't know how to fix that. Hmm. Do I need two wide? Hold on, would two wide do it? No, it wouldn't actually. No, it wouldn't, would it? Because it would still overlap on, yeah. You need to just walk right through this. Oh, I hate that so much. Man, that is silly as hell, dude. That is so silly as hell. Yeah, so we're not going to use gates then. Okay. Because this is an issue. Dear developers, fix your shit. Thanks for giving us something we can't even use. Okay. That's fine. Um. So gates are a... Gates are a no. Because they don't work. Good to know. And it's not set to through either, which is just wonderful. So I can get rid of the gates then because they don't work at all. Unless I do something that I wonder hold on I wonder hold on now I I wonder I mean that might work nope Yeah, this might work right here, actually. Hold on. This might work. Yeah, there we go. Can't walk through it now. That's how, that's how you fix this issue. But then the 
fencing looks stupid. Oh, man. Okay. Um. Well. Well, I hit the microphone. Whoops. Um. Hi, Mr. Kitty Cat. How are you doing today? Hi. I got your tail. <laughs> no, I don't have your tail. Um, what can I do to fix that? Hmm. Hmm, 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 What can I do? I can't really do anything. I don't have any assets or well, tiles that, that I can use to fix that that issue with the doors or the gates because the gates they don't work because of that issue because yeah <coughs> hmm I wonder But it still leaves that gap, though. It's just unfortunate. Hmm. And it looks unnatural being there, too. Hmm. What can I do? Can I maybe... Hold on. That might work. Hold on, I wonder. Can I block it with that? This might work. I doubt it will, but we'll see. Nope. Okay. Yeah, this does not work. Unfortunate. Hmm. Unless, no. Hmm. Yeah, I need something, I need something here. I need something here to prevent that from happening. Like a visible thing right here. Where you can actually go through the door. To hide that you can go through the door here. But the question is what? I guess, I guess I can put a singular fence down, then it wouldn't look out of place. Maybe. Hmm. Actually, no. Hold on. No, 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 no. I can do... Hold on, I wonder. Instead of a fence, I can do a statue on either side. That way it looks natural. That way it looks like they actually put something there. Now, how does that look? Ah, oh, man. Seriously, dude? Okay, what if I move them down? No. Yeah, what if I move them down? Hold on, I'm curious now. No, but then you can just walk. That's not going to work either. Um, What if I move them up? Like so. Did I not save it? 
I thought I did. I thought I hit control S. That doesn't work either. Because you can still just do this. Damn it. Um. I need something that looks natural. Something that belongs. I know what I can put there, actually. No, hold on. No. I know what I can put there. Guards. Yeah, no. I know what I can put there. <laughs> this will be what we put there. No, actually. Placeholder, a guard. Yeah, well, let's do this. And that's our fix right there. That way you can't just bypass it. And they're on the other side of the door, but you can see them, which I don't like. Hmm. Oh, I wonder. Hold on. Um. I wonder if that would work. Hold on. No, I copied this, you fucking piece of shit titties. Would that work? Give the illusion that they're behind something and you can't actually see them. Mmm. Mmm. Actually, no, that right there would do what I need, I think. Hold on. Would that actually do what I need it to do? Yeah, no, it does. Yeah, it does. I, I just need to find a way to hide that gap, though. That's all I need to do. Ah, oh, man. Okay. How do I hide the gap? How do I hide that gap? Hmm. I don't want that gap showing, so how do I hide it? Can I maybe layer over an event to where it won't? I don't think that'll work. Actually, it might. No, it won't. Because these doors are not part of the actual tile sets. Bummer. Um, how do I hide that gap? Is there a, hold on, I wonder. Is there a sample map where they use it? They didn't use it at all. Because they knew of the issue. Yeah, 
They didn't use it at all. Well, I mean, actually, no, they might have. That's right, it's not an actual tile set. It's only an event. So, you can't tell that way. Plus, I don't think, huh, does it load up events? I'm curious. Yeah, no, it does not. So, yeah, so they wouldn't have used it at all then. Fair enough. Um, delete this then. And then do this. Yeah, so they wouldn't have used it at all. How do I hide that gap though? <laughs> oh yeah. Um I could put a tree there. Oh, ooh, would that work? Hold on now, I'm curious. Would that would that work? Hold on. Would this work? Ah, son of a monkey's uncle. Um. Would this work? Hold on now, I'm curious. I, I mean it does, but when I do the event for the door to open, which, hold on, I can find out now, actually, hold on, I'm curious. Um, where is my door event? Right here. No. Close all this. Copy this. Okay. <laughs> Paste the Renos. Save it. Do it. Okay. Ah, oh. it ain't gonna work in general. Okay, well, never mind then. I didn't. I okay. Yeah, it ain't gonna work in general. Um. Um, because it has that black hole in it. Can I do a different gate then? I mean, I wouldn't consider those ones. Oh no, they are sci-fi, aren't they? I wouldn't consider these sci-fi. How are these sci-fi gates? How, okay, hold on. I want to see where are the um. Hold on. I I want to look at this closer. It is characters, right? I believe. No. Yes, it is. I could do this. Those are not doors. <laughs> Those are not doors. I'm sorry. Um, sci-fi door. Yeah, those are definitely sci-fi. Sci-fi door. Those are not doors. These are not doors. These are teleporters. Get your shit right. Um, sci-fi gate preview. No, wrong one. Number three. Okay, I want to... Can I view it in the actual files? Hold on. Without having to export it. Um, images. And then characters. Um, where's sci fi door? It doesn't have three. Where's three? It's not listed. Oh no, it's gate. Okay, no, no. Um, I'm an idiot. So how are these sci-fi? 
These are not sci-fi gates, I'm sorry. These are not sci-fi at all. These are medieval. How are these sci-fi? <coughs> How are these sci-fi? They're medieval based. There's nothing on these that makes them sci-fi. I'm sorry. I mean, if you're talking about the lock here, that's not sci-fi based. You can have a lock in medieval times as well. So this is mislabeled. That's mislabeled. Fixed it. <laughs> I fixed it because yes. And it is I need to actually fix it, fix it now. Um how is it labeled in here? How is gate Okay, so exclamation dollar sign. Okay. Exclamation dollar sign. Exclamation dollar sign. Fixed. There's nothing about those that make them sci fi. I'm sorry. They are medieval gates. I'm sorry. They they just are. Oh and look, there it is there it is, right there. Where it should be. <clears throat> oh my god, it fits perfectly in that hole. Oh my god. It actually fits perfectly in that hole. Holy shit. <laughs> and I, oh, dude, that is perfect. I can have the guards behind it too. Oh, that is awesome. Oh, bro, that is awesome. Hold on now. Paste this in. Um, Where is the sound effect for... for it? Edit. No. Yeah, that one. Okay, that, that's perfect. Oh, there's a glitch on it too. Yeah. So, There's a glitch on it. I remember I couldn't fix that. Oh no. Okay, hold on. It's when it opens. Okay. What if I make it wait? Edit. Four. <laughs> See what this does. I'm curious. <laughs> Cause it's it's a text, it's a um graphical glitch, and it's like double opening it. Yeah, no, it's still doing it. Yeah, it's still doing it. I don't know. I don't know if I can fix it or not. Um. I don't know if I can fix that. <clears throat> I don't think I was ever able to fix that, honestly. What if I... No. T 
10 frames. 10 frames. And then... Oh, that's better. It doesn't do it now. I fixed it. I fixed it. Yeah, that's why it was going too fast. Okay. That is awesome. Okay, I fixed it. I'm heavy with that. And it fits in the hole where I where the other gates do not fit fit. That's perfect. That's awesome. Okay, we made progress. It wasn't what I wanted to work on, per se, but it's progress. I mean, I wanted to make an entrance. I didn't necessarily want to put a gate down now. I wanted to do it during the actual event process of the entire the entire game. But getting this to work properly or closer to proper is progress. Because I was never able to get this to work properly before now, ever. So that's a win for me right there. That, yeah, that's a win for me right there. <clears throat> what if I slow it down on it's hold on yeah it's closing too fast okay I also need to oh I never I need to reverse this yeah this isn't done I Oh yeah. I need to reverse this process down here. Yeah, I need to reverse it down there. And then it would be, oh yeah, I forgot about that. I did have a better version of this, but I, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So I can copy and paste this. I can actually get rid of this one. Copy it. Paste it in. And then I can edit this one. This one I can get rid of. And then I can do it here. So that you can no longer go through it this one needs to be turn right this one needs to be turn left turn down through off and that should do it I think and then that should hopefully make it to where it's proper. Hell yeah! Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, oh, yes! Okay, now we change the sounds. Do I want to import it from VX Ace? <laughs> if you're not gonna my door, use the fucking doorbell, please. That's what it's there for. I'm 
not going to answer if you don't do that. I'm sorry. Do I need to put a vagina on my doorbell? Because I will freaking do that. Because everyone loves to finger those. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone loves the finger pussy. <laughs> uh, I don't care. I'm not here to work on it anyway. <laughs> I am not here to work on that. Uh, I'm getting kind of hot, honestly. Um, I might... No, I want to actually hear these sounds. Um, new event. Uh, where is... Where is it at? I might turn my AC back on, yeah. Um... Play sound effects. Hmm... <laughs> Okay, that one's three. No. It's the same, just different pitch. It's the same sound, just different pitch. That's really all it is. So there's really no point in me doing that. Okay, cool. No, I know. The sound and visual are off. Okay. The sound and visual are off. Yeah. Well, actually, maybe not. Maybe not. Yeah, no, maybe not. If I increase it to 15, what would it do? <laughs> Save. If I could have a sound throughout the entire process. Now see, it sounds like it's too, it's moving too slow now. What if I What if I do this? Yep, I think I think that might do it, honestly. I really do. Wait, am I using the, hold on. Was I using oh, the wrong audio the whole time? Whoopsie. <laughs> hold on. I was. Oh my God, I'm an idiot. <clears throat> Sorry for the double audio. Whoops.
my mistake. I did not realize that it was on speaker audio and not headset audio. Even though I have my headsets on, I thought it was coming out of my headset. Until now. I think it's perfect. I really do. Again, I apologize for the possible double audio. I apologize. I'm still getting used to these headphones and having to go over, over there and, um, you know, actually turn them on <laughs> or turn them off. So, my mistake shit happens. We're moving on now. Um, and yeah, this will actually work wonders. I copied the grass. So, copy the fucking grass. My god. Another bug in the fucking program. I swear to god, dude. That's been there since day fucking one. Eighty bucks for this program, by the way. And there are multiple bugs that they have not fixed. Just saying. When you go to copy a tile, it does not always copy. When you go to copy a line of event code, it does not always copy. Just to, just a heads up. I love this program, but the minor freaking bugs. The fact that I can save my fucking project right now and I can still undo it. I can still undo what I saved is freaking stupid as hell. I'm sorry. Like, that is the stupidest decision ever. Another dumb decision and I have pointed this out before this lovely sixty dollar program that has and I'm gonna point something out this one uses Ruby code okay look what's built into it built in scripting and yet Ruby code is probably more than likely the most basic code out there. It is more than likely the weakest code out there. And look what it can do. It can do built-in coding. JavaScript, however, cannot do that. What the hell? Why can JavaScript not do built-in coding? when the most basic and probably the weakest code known to man can do it. And this is how basic Ruby code is. This is all it is. That's an entire code right there for a common event. And that's how basic it is. Find the same line of code in JavaScript and you'll have like 5,000 lines of code just to make this work in JavaScript. And yet it can't do a built-in editor? Bullshit. I'm sorry. Freaking bullshit. Another thing they forgot to add in on day fucking one. magnification this one had it day one MZ and MV did not have that day one I fought for MZ or oh, what it was yeah I fought for MZ to have this and it's nowhere near as good as this one <clears throat> it doesn't have these options at all it is it's it's 
it's it's pitiful, but it's there. It's pitiful, but it's there. And it did not have it day one at all. $80 program, by the way. I love it. The only reason why I'm now using it is because they added transfer map zoom functionality. If it didn't have this right here, I wouldn't use it. And now you cannot control mouse wheel at all, which is stupid. They need to add that in, in my opinion. Or, or, give us what VX Ace has. One, one, one half, one fourth, one eighth. Just give us those four buttons and it's perfect. And it's the same developers, by the way, for every iteration. The same developers. And they forgot to add in the most basic function. Zooming for a very, very wonderful function of the program. Yeah. The same developers every time. And they forgot to add this in. And I bet they forgot to add it in in the new one as well for Unite. I don't know. I'm not going to get Unite because, again, Unity. We all know they're blunders. <sighs> yeah. It's pretty sad. That's why in the last video I recommended getting this one to begin with. I mean, I recommend MZ, but this one is complete. No bugs at all. Well, there's a minor bug, but it doesn't really amount to much at all. Like, it's in here. Uh, da, 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 da. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, it's not there. Um, I forgot where it was. I think it's in here. Uh, where was it? It's a minor bug, and it does not amount to much at all. Like, everything still works properly, supposedly, and they never fixed it. I don't know why, but I forgot where it was. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Yeah, it's right here. This is where it is, under um, action patterns for enemies. So, say you want HP, so 0 to 100%. Watch what it does. 0 to 0 percent. It's a bug, okay? But it's still reading correctly in the program. If I change it to this, see? It's a bug. There's also an instance where you can make it do, I think, Is it like MP, I think? Maybe they fixed it. I don't know. Hold on. Maybe they fixed it. Yeah, they might have actually fixed it. I don't know. Yeah, there it is, right there, yeah. So, 19 to 100%. It does this then. Yeah, so that bug still exists. But it's supposedly reading correctly. I don't know if it does or not, honestly. <laughs> but, yeah. It's a minor bug, though. Nothing compared to what this one has. <laughs> Nothing like missing features, or it won't copy and paste event stuff, or it won't I right clicked there and it didn't actually do it. I had to, I had to click again, which is a bug. Well, I wonder. I'm curious. Hold on. No, it's okay. I guess I don't know. Weird. Now see, that's not where I'm clicking at. That's not what I'm clicking at. <laughs> that shouldn't be a thing. What the hell, dude? Hmm. I don't know. <clears throat> I 
I got no idea, but that is done. We got ourselves a gate. That is perfect. I think I'm going to put a cut here. I'm getting hot. It's getting late. I got a gate made. Perfect. I relabeled the train the poor translation for a sci-fi gate to its proper term because there's nothing about the gates that I relabeled that deems them to be sci-fi at all. You can have a you can have that kind of gate in medieval times. So yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and put a stop here. I know I didn't really get much done, but in my opinion I got I got a lot done in my opinion. Because normally it would have taken me a week to figure out what I just did. No joke. I'm not kidding. Just to get that event to work properly, to the way it is now, it would have taken me a week. Not joking. So, I got a lot done. In my opinion. More so than, well, yeah. I was going to do more, but I need to turn my AC on. I'm hot. <laughs> Actually, what's my PC temp? <clears throat> I mean, that's not bad. I mean, and that's just basically sitting idle. I don't know why it's running at 7,200. I have, it always does, I guess. I don't know. It's weird. But yeah, I mean, that's not bad. It's like 104 degrees Fahrenheit. And if anything above 60 idle, that's bad. So, I mean, yeah, so if, I, if it's hot, I'm hot. Well, yeah. And it, and it was 90 degrees outside today. So, that's why I'm also hot. But yeah, anyways, I am, like I said, going to go ahead and put a stop here and I will see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day.